everyone, Happy New Year! I really hope you all enjoyed and spent a really good time for Christmas and New Year holiday. I wanted to start this 2017 year with my everyday makeup look. This is the makeup I'm doing for foundation and complexion and eyes since the last few weeks. I really enjoy it and I won't lie to you, I love to change my lips pretty every day, so it depends. If I have dry lips, I only apply a lip balm. If my lips are really fine, I love to play between nude and pink shades and maybe sometimes a more bold lips, like a really bold red. So if you want to see this look, just keep on watching. I start by applying my Stop Spot from Guerlain. It's uh, quite a medium heavy texture. It's basically a product which will cover my blemishes and my acne. And at the same time, it will neutralize my spot and my acne. So there so will be a, like a medical effect on my acne, which won't move during the day. I apply it before my foundation. As it's a treatment, I prefer to apply it like that. For foundation, I'm using Le Meteorite Baby Glow from Guerlain in the shade Light and Medium. So I'm mixing those two shades because I'm really between those two shades, basically. It's not the most um, affordable way to find your foundation, but if there is a product that you really like and you can't find the perfect match for your skin, you always can buy two shades. And I apply it with a beauty blender just because as I applied my stop spot just before I don't want to rub uh, the product uh, from my blemishes areas so I prefer to dab gently with my beauty blender. To cover my last blemishes that I can still see, I'm using Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage in the shade CS3. And I apply it with a small buffing brush from Zoeva. For my concealer, I'm using Clarins Instant Light Concealer in the shade 01. I really, really love this concealer because it's a creamy texture, really easy to blend. It's not a full coverage, so it's still natural. And I blend it with my beauty blender. To set on my base, I'm using the Givenchy Prism Visage Powder in the shade Beige Dentelle and I apply it with my powder brush from Bobbi Brown. I really, really love this powder. I am using it since the last two months. It gives me this really healthy, not tan, but you know this really spring and healthy face. It's a really fine powder. My makeup doesn't move with this powder and yeah, I really love it. For brows, I'm using Burberry Effortless Eyebrow Pencil. It's a classic. Uh, I used it at the beginning of my channel. I know this product well. Uh, I really like it. It's, uh, yeah, it's a basic. I like to brush my brows first and after I cover the areas where I need some hairs. For my eyes, I'm using the Eye Color Contour from Burberry. It's basically a creamy texture for your eyes. I apply it directly with the bullet on my eyes and I blend with my fingers. And it's the easiest way I found to do my eyes in like one minute. It's an awesome product. Honestly, it doesn't move and I can assure you that I can have some oily eyelid sometimes and this product doesn't move. I have tried many products like that. This one, I'm so impressed about this product. So I apply it on my lid and on my lower lash line. Just to add a little bit of definition, I'm using the Burberry Eyeliner Call. Again, I love this eyeliner. It doesn't move. 
it add a little bit of dimension to my eyes. It completes perfectly well this look. And I like to smudge it with a small uh, smudging brush from Zoeva, just to give me a softer look. For mascara, I'm using Guerlain Cils d'Enfer Maxi Lash in the shade black. Again, it's a sample. It's a good volumizing mascara. To bronze my skin, I'm using Hula Bronzer from Benefit with my bronzer brush from Bobbi Brown. I really like this bronzer. It's a classic in the makeup world. Uh, it's not too orange, that's why I really like it. It gives me a really natural bronzing effect on my face. And for blush, I'm using Hour Glass Lighting Blush in the shade Mood Exposure. I love this blush. It's pink, but it's warm. It gives me a really lovely color effect on my cheeks. To add some light on my face, I'm using Guerlain Le Meteorite Powder in the shade Medium and I apply this powder on the top of my cheekbones, a little bit on my nose and on my cupid's bow just to add some light in the center of my face. For lips, I will first apply the Chanel Lip Pencil in the shade Signature, which is a lovely beige uh, lip pencil, a good base. You can apply just this lip pencil if you want. But I complete this lips look with my Zoeva Velvet Lipstick in the shade Faint of Hurt that I really love. It's a matte liquid lipstick which stay a long time. This pink is lovely on an everyday basis. I did a swatches video about the Velvet and Laker liquid lipsticks from Zoeva, if you want to check out. And yeah, I really, I really love this sort of matte formula. And this is the final look. So as you could see, my skin is not at its best since the last few weeks. I had some acne issue, but I managed to, to cover everything for an everyday look. Not a full cover flawless skin, but it's not my kind of makeup on an everyday basis at least. So yeah, I really hope you enjoy this video. Don't hesitate to let me know in the comment bar below what you thought about this makeup or the product I used and what do you use for your everyday makeup look for this 2017 year. I wish you a lovely day and I will see you in my next video. Bye!